Comment ça va aujourd'hui Océane Ah bah ça va très bien, et on est très très excités à bord de cette journée et je suis tous une expérience incroyable pour nous, je suis tout bas, on vient d'une petite île et de jouer contre des joueuses à un niveau plus plus élevé que nous donc euh, franchement on est excités comme jamais et prêts à donner tout ce qu'on a et à faire notre mieux. Super super, vous allez rebondir sur la journée d'hier parce que vous êtes dernière de poule, est-ce que vous avez mis des choses en place Ben on a un peu on mis un peu en place, on a dit ben on fait notre mieux, on se concentre et on, a, on pense qu'on a peut-être une chance aujourd'hui. Donc on donne ce qu'on a, on est focus et juste on garde le sourire et on s'amuse. <rire> Trop bien. Et pour finir, est-ce qu'il y aurait une équipe qui vous impressionne plus qu'une autre Alors oui, je pense que c'est en Bordeaux et la Nouvelle-Zélande. Je pense plus Bordeaux car elles sont vraiment une équipe très très forte, elles ont une cohésion incroyable. Et elle joue franchement trop bien et du coup, ben, pour nous, c'était une, une expérience mais incroyable de jouer contre elle. Franchement, enfin, on les admire, quoi. C'était magnifique, donc je pense que c'est Bordeaux. I'm with uh, Mare Idelia from uh, Seville. Uh, girls, how are you today? We are uh, really, 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 really for this uh, game and we have a lot of, uh, um, a lot of. Uh, we are we are really prepared for this day game. We we have a lot of illusion for this day. What do you think of your uh, first day of competition? We really play really good. Uh, we won two out of three games yesterday, and we we know that we are uh, re ready for any team that we are going to play today. <laughs> uh, is there a team here? Is there a team here that impressed you? Uh, yes, we are really impressed about all the team because because we are in the world uh, tournament. But uh, we think that uh, New Zealand is a good uh, team. But we we will uh, play against them and we will do our best. <laughs> okay, and last uh, question. Obviously, you are twins. How does it feel to play uh, with uh, her twins? It's really funny to play uh, in this at the same uh, moment uh, in the same game because we the the defense uh, maybe is uh, disconcerted about us and they say they a lot of people think that we are the same person but we are too so it's really funny and really good. <laughs> Thank you girls. Thank you. <laughs> comment ça va Adèle aujourd'hui et comment se sent l'équipe? Uh, ça va très bien. Uh, on est motivé. C'est une deuxième journée, on, enfin on va essayer de l'aborder comme on a abordé la première, donc avec une victoire dès le début, pour se remettre bien dans le bain et euh, pouvoir être sereine ensuite pour la suite du tournoi. Oui, et euh, qu'est-ce que vous pensez des, des équipes que vous allez affronter aujourd'hui Est-ce qu'il y en a qui vous font peur ou pas Il euh, ben, y a l'équipe de Pretoria, on les a joués quand on est parti en Afrique du Sud déjà, c'est une belle équipe, on les connaît, on connaît certaines joueuses, elles ont des grandes qualités, surtout ben, de vitesse. Et ça monte très vite euh, défensivement, donc euh, ouais, je pense que ça peut être euh, un très beau match euh, à voir et euh, aussi très agréable à jouer euh, des deux côtés. Je pense qu'on va prendre du plaisir et bien jouer au rugby des deux côtés. Ça va être sympa. Ok, super, merci Adèle. Merci à vous. I'm with uh, Shakira from uh, South Africa. Shakira, you just play against uh, Bordeaux. I heard that uh, there is a, a problem with the referee. Uh, tell us uh, about that. Um, the referee was more focused on us, not refing the high circles that they were doing. So there's the problem that we have and um, we scored a very beautiful try that the other opponent had to complain. It's, we, it was like out, but it was not. So that's one thing they're still checking. I think we, we won the game, but we still have to get the um, confirmation from the ref because they're still really looking at the game. So, yeah. so uh, uh, a situation like that uh, does affect uh, your team? Yes, it does affect, it breaks us very, um, it's so emotional because we played our heart out and um, we have to get this kind of ref, but it's okay, uh, we don't know, we'll get over this. And now uh, let's talk about you, um, how does it feel to represent your country here in Bordeaux? Uh, it feels so good, it's such a great experience to come here and represent um, South Africa and tax as well. So, um, I feel more excited and I'm learning. This is a new experience and it's so enjoyable. On est avec Florian de l'équipe de Bordeaux qui vient de gagner la demi-finale contre les États-Unis. Alors ça fait quoi Mais très content, très content d'avoir gagné euh, un match dur, dur dans l'impact, dans le physique. Mais euh, très content de, de, de pouvoir gagner. En plus, c'était notre objectif d'aller en finale. Donc euh, chose faite. Maintenant, euh, on va récupérer parce que ça tapait. Et, euh, et ouais, content, content. 
Donc euh, le programme pour demain, c'est récupérer, il y a des choses de prévues, des entraînements Alors demain, on récupère tous, parce que comme j'ai dit, ça tapait. Et après, euh, et après mais du coup, euh, on a quartier libre et on mange ensemble le soir pour, euh, pour profiter, pour bien préparer la, la finale. Je suis avec Mathéo, un Français qui joue pour l'équipe des, des USA, au Ourit. Mathéo, vous vous arrêtez aux portes de la finale. Qu'est-ce qu'on ressent à ce moment-là euh, Très déçu parce qu'on sait qu'on est très proche de, 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 de l'équipe bordelaise. Euh, quand on, dit, on arrive à ce tournoi, petite équipe des états unis personne euh, nous, nous pensait qu'on pouvait arriver aux portes de la finale. Euh, premier match, on, on, on gagne contre l'Australie, on gagne contre le Canada, on perd contre la Nouvelle-Zélande, on perd contre l'Afrique du Sud. En demi-finale contre la France, on s'est dit, de toute façon, on a, on a toutes nos chances. On joue, quand on dit, on est le, le, petit, pays, le petit pays du rugby. Euh, franchement, je suis très, très fier des mecs. Pour la plupart, ça fait 3-4 ans qu'ils font du rugby. On ne s'en rend pas compte, mais c'est énorme pour eux. Uh, it's the semi-finals today. Big game against uh, Cape Town. How do you feel? We feel really good. We're really excited. We obviously lost them early on in the comp. Very close game. So today, um, we're looking to match them physically and, and put on a bit of a show for everyone that comes down to watch. Last question, Sam, uh, for you. What are the key of the match? We think physicality is going to be really important today. Um, we want to match them physically, and then we've got a lot of pace out wide and some really good backs that we want to be able to unleash. So that's our, that's our plan today. I am with the coach and the captain of uh, Cap Town. Guys, congratulations, uh, you are in the final of the tournament. I guess uh, you're proud of uh, your team. Yes, very proud. Um, you know, it was a tough day for us yesterday uh, and uh, we came off a loss against Sydney, so we had to regroup and we did that exceptionally well last night. Um, it was always going to be a big game against the Kiwis and uh, we put a plan in place that the boys could be proud of and um, credit to uh, New Zealand, they, they played really well and they had us under pressure for some parts of the game but we ended off strongly and uh, we're really happy with the results. You talk about uh, New Zealand, does a victory uh, over a uh, historic rival uh, taste uh, better? Yeah, yeah uh, it does taste very nice. Um, we got one over them in the first game of the competition and we we did so today again. Um, it's always quite, a, it's quite an honor to face the Haka. Um, some of us haven't faced it before, so it was our first time in the opening game of the competition and you can really feel them laying out their challenge, so you almost need to step up to it and coming out with the W after that is, is very nice. Okay, and uh, for the final, France uh, will try to take the, the title from you. What are you, uh, what are the, the expectations for this match? Yeah, I think it's going to be a tough game. Obviously, we lost to them in the rounds uh, early on in the week. And, um, you know, for us, it's just getting our plans right like we did today. Um, it, it's an honor for us to be playing Bordeaux in the final as the host uh, university. Uh, and uh, we'll plan properly for them. And, um, you know, we're looking forward to the challenge. Um, they're a good side and um, we were come to be beaten by them in the first game. So we'll look forward to the challenge in the final. I'm with uh, Mariana Yalerandra from uh, Mexico. Girls, you just have a win your match. How does it feel? Well, we're really, we're really excited to have our first win yesterday and then to keep going and have a win today. So we want to finish the, the day uh, the same way. Despite uh, the wins, uh, what your team could do uh, better in the future? Uh, well, we are learning about everything around. I mean, I mean uh, training, the warm up, uh, how is the culture with rugby here? And uh, our purp uh, purpose is to uh, take all that and bring that to the, to the country, to our country, to our club. Yeah, we're learning from each team, seeing how they play and trying to adapt and using um, what we have our advantages to, well, to our advantage and uh, see where we are a little bit weaker and trying to improve on that in every game. And uh, last question, uh, how does it feel to represent your country and your university? Well, we're really, really excited to be the only university from Latin America and we want to have a lot more of opportunities to come to tournaments like this because we get to grow a lot as a team and as, she, as Ale said, we get to take all of the things that we learned here that you have a big ro rugby culture and take them back to Mexico. Uh, we're very proud uh, of our ourselves and um, the, team. the team, everybody. <laughs>
So Kelsen, how do you feel after the match? Was it easier? Uh, no, no game's ever easy, you know, we all we go out there with the same expectations but it's always good when you've got a team like um, I get to play with. I'm lucky and um, yeah, it's good to be a part of it. Okay, so Delia, how disappointed are you to lose just before the final? Uh, well, we, we knew that this game was uh, really uh, difficult, so we, we tried to do our best, but uh, we were aware about the level of the, the game. So we, we, we are some kind of disappointed, but we, we are realists and we know that the level of this game. I think that the tournament is well organized. Uh, uh, I think that it's a great opportunity for all the teams or of all, all the world. And I think that it's a good opportunity for uh, anybody that plays rugby to be at a good level and play the, the, our favorite uh, uh, sport. <laughs> So Eli, how were your match today? How was my match? Um, very good. Yeah, I feel like um, they scored the first try and came out really strong, but um, we worked really hard to, to get the win and I'm really proud of the girls. So maybe can you say about the, the better points of your team and the cons? Uh, I think just work rate, working really hard for each other, um, trusting each other. Yeah, we've gelled really quickly um, in this comp, so yeah. And something that you can uh, increase? Um, I think to increase we'll just working working on our patterns a little bit more, um, taking taking teams to the edge and edge and edge and um, finding that space so we can play smarter, not harder. Are you proud of you, of your team, to be qualified to, to the final? Oh, absolutely. Considering we came together um, six days ago and then have gelled um, this, this well, it's awesome. Yeah, I'm really proud. I'm with Kelly, captain of uh, New Zealand. Kelly, big game, uh, big win today. How does it feel? Uh, it feels great to come out hissing with the girls. Like we knew we could do it, but we didn't expect to go it that far. So we're really stoked with everything and how we came across with it. Okay, what uh, were the key of the match for you? Uh, key was physicality and intent, and just executing our tap plays. Yeah, uh, personal question now. What do you think of your match? Of my match, um, I thought it was pretty good. Work rate was good. <laughs> it was hot out there, but kept going for the full 14 minutes. So I was stoked. 
And uh, how does it feel to be the captain of this team? Uh, it's a big privilege. Eh? I came in not knowing a lot about sevens, but coming out being captain, I was overwhelmed, honoured.